Yeah, I think you're gonna need something bigger than that to unthaw your boy. Hello everybody, I'm Garola64 and welcome back to Sonic Mania Mods. Today we've got Sonic Mania Blazy Mix and we also have Ice Cap Zone. I, uh, I've been wanting to check out Blazy Mix for a while now because it is quite the really cool mod. No pun intended because we're an Ice Cap, of course. And I figured Blaze would fit into this level pretty well because she's the exact opposite, so technically she doesn't fit in at all. But uh, see, we have both of these here today and that prevents me from having to run through Green Hill for the 50th time this week. And I'm into that. We're going to be checking out a bunch of features of both Ice Cap and the Blaze mod today. And then, if you want to see more of either of them, you could always go into the description and check out both mods for yourself, which I urge you to do as usual. Because, I mean, as always, the mod showcases aren't specifically about me showing you every single thing in the mod, because if I did that, then what's really the point of you playing the mod, right? Like, you might want to go play it yourself, have some fun. Speaking of fun, we got the special stages here, and you can even see in the distance that UFO has a Sol Emerald instead of the Chaos Emerald. And I, I know some people say it's Soul Emerald, but it's S-O-L, so... I guess I'm S-O-L, because people are gonna yell at me in the comments anyway, regardless of what I say, so... It doesn't really matter. But yeah, no, Blaze has her own special stage model, which is really great. Not a whole lot of mods do that. It just shows the quality of this particular mod. Definitely, uh... Definitely a cut above some of the rest. And she even has an alternate running animation once she hits Mach 3, but we might actually hit the Soul Emerald before we hit Mach 3. Because it's right there. There you go. She kind of does like her... She ran kind of weird in Sonic Rush, and they kind of mimicked that with this 3D model. Looks kind of weird in the special stages. But hey, we even got text on the screen here. Blaze got a Soul Emerald. Living large today, fellas. So there's that. There's also blue sphere sprites, which I can show you real quick, but I, I kind of don't want to take too much away from Ice Cap, because that's another big point of the video. Which, yeah, here's, here's blue spheres if you ever want to go into blue spheres again, but you know, my philosophy is just don't. I just thought I'd show you Blaze's little animation for when she's off balance as well. This mod has a lot of sprites, and they're all custom, I believe. Like, that's why this mod took so long to actually make the, the jump to plus and just to come out originally. All of these sprites were made for Mania, for this mod specifically, and I think that's pretty swell. Also, Blaze with the bubble shield. Also, Sonic, you look pretty okay in that color, to be honest. And wouldn't you know it, you actually need to be frozen for this part because, you know, ice cap. So, uh, hold on a second. Gotta... Gotta, gotta fail miserably, sorry. That's the quote, right? That's the quote that Sonic is always known for? Gotta fail miserably, yeah! No, that's Sonic Team's motto, sorry. <laughs> Alright, so... What's what's going on up here, gents? We got a, a lightning shield, thank goodness. Also, Blaze is over Sonic, if you couldn't tell. She can use the elemental shield abilities, she can use the drop dash, she can use the peel out, she can use whatever you want her to use. And she also has a cool super form, or... I was gonna say a hot super form, because it's burning Blaze, but that sounds kinda not right. So I think I'm gonna go with a cool super form, if that's okay with you. But first, we need some rings. But, I mean, technically, I don't need rings for this, because I have a mod loader code on for it, but... Like, if you only have two rings, you're not gonna be able to see it for very long, and... I know I was screen-sharing Sonic Mania the other, day, the other day on Discord, and, uh, I engaged Superform at, like, three rings, immediately lost it, and as soon as I lost it, I jumped right into an enemy and died immediately, and there, there was many, many a guffaw to be had there. Please. Alright, but let's not get squished! Terrible memories from the race with Red Hot Sonic the other day. If you didn't see me race Red Hot Sonic in Sonic 3 Battle Race, I, uh, I was dismembered by that platform crushing me to death. Also, here we go, Burning Blaze. Also, I always really liked Super Sonic's Frozen Sprites since Mania, the Mania Plus update, because he looks so... He doesn't- he looks like he's like, wow, even with the seven Chaos Emeralds, I can still get Frozen Solid. How's that? Also, Burning Blaze looks really good in this mod. And that makes me feel super overpowered. And the Rush music, thank you. It's so good. Oh god. There's the push sprite. I know, I'm pushing my luck here, I know. But uh... And that actually reminds me of uh... What was that ROM hack again? Red Hot Sonic recorded a review about a while back. It was like Sonic 1 Scorched Edition or something? Wasn't there like a flaming... 
like scorched Sonic instead of Super Sonic and he was red or something? I'm remembering something like that, and that's what that frozen sprite reminds me of. Or just Red Hot Sonic himself, because it is a red Sonic. But enough about Red Hot Sonic for today. Anyway, <laughs> uh, let's get on up here. This section is scary, because if you fall all the way down there, it's gonna take a bit to get back. And I'm just- I'm not good at video games, so it's very likely that I will fall down to my demise. But not right- No, wait a minute! That was cheap! Oh god! Oh, come on. That was like six whole things going wrong at once. Do you guys see all that? That was unfair to the max. But I almost pulled it off, too. Also, now we are losing the jump height boost, so that's unfortunate. And there we are safely going to this side this time instead of off the edge. There we go! Alright, now we can continue to the end of the level. I think we're almost at the end. Yes, this is the end. And unfortunately, Ice Cap only has one act currently, but one heck of a good act so far, let me tell you. Also, I wonder if five rings will be enough to cheese this boss fight. Because I hate this boss and I don't want to fight it. Heck yeah, look at I only needed four rings. You tell me that that wasn't clutch. Alright. And that's all for Ice Cap. Of course, the Blaze mod has much more to show you. I, uh, I very much urge you to all check this one out in the description, both of these actually, because they're both fantastic. And you're able to play with Blaze throughout the entire game, of course, whereas Ice Cap, you can only use for a little bit. But then you trans transition into Press Garden Act 2, almost seamlessly, because I guess everything exploded, and you know how that works. I think I'm gonna continue on with Blaze just a little bit here, so you can see a bit more of the sprites, and uh, I guess we can fight Heavy Shinobi, because I mean this level's not very long anyway. And Blaze is an entire half of this video, so I guess she is important, even if you don't think so. I mean, she is one of the best characters in the series, in my opinion, just because she's not boring. Or maybe you do think she's boring. I don't know, maybe she- it depends on what game she's in. Because in Sonic 06, she was pretty boring. Then again, was that really Blaze, or was that just some random character? Why does she have frozen sprites now? Was there something about Ice Cap Zone making it so she didn't have frozen sprites? That's weird. Okay, so we got more out of this. That's good. The idea was to show a bunch of poses. Maybe not necessarily everything, but... Oh, she's very upset. <laughs> It's okay, don't worry about it. You'll be out of there. Like, Burning Blaze can be frozen, huh? I guess Sonic shouldn't be too upset about being frozen as Super Sonic then, because if literally Burning Blaze, who is a fire elemental and souped up with the Sol Emeralds, can be uh, put on ice, then I, I feel like the Chaos Emeralds probably don't mean much in that situation. Free me. There we go. This is a really great mod, though. I would love to do like a full playthrough of this. I mean, it's kind of just a regular playthrough of Sonic Mania, but it's just fun. I mean, if I were to do another playthrough of Sonic Mania at any point, definitely be using character mods. She's even got like an out of here animations kind of thing too, if you've been noticing. When she goes off springs and falls down, she does like a little, she does a very smooth like transition from the spring sprite into a, uh, into like a falling, which is really nice. The only other mod I've seen do that is uh, Sonic Gaiden, which, of course, I'm not sure if that has been shown off yet specifically, but uh, I I've seen a lot of stuff behind the scenes, and just, like, there's some really nice stuff going on there. I'm not gonna elaborate too much, because I don't wanna... I don't wanna get killed by Arrow's ninjas, if he's got any, but... <laughs> Let's get another Victory Blaze, and we'll end it off for today. She has a nice little regal bow, and that's it. And she gets transported through time, just like Sonic 06, so wait, wait! No, I didn't want this! <laughs> okay, but yeah, that's gonna be all for today, so if you like this video and you haven't already, please make sure you subscribe, click the bell, follow my Twitter, and join the Discord to keep up with more Sonic Mania Plus mods and other things that aren't Sonic Mania Plus mods, because I do a lot of things. And there she is, in the future. Except the future isn't as terrible as it usually is. Anyway, regardless, uh, I would also like to give a huge thank you to my current sponsors, whom include... Please zoom in, phone screen. That's not one of the people, that was a that was a, a, a wish. We have Nick46, Jaded Indolent, Silva PhD, Bob the Hedgehog Gamer, Game Masters, Cringe Channel, Cosmic Mushroom, 
Lucas Tallman, Nico the Person, Mitron, Kenneth Gutierrez, Knuckles Channel 3 and Knuckles, Henry S, Rob Morrison, Mega Traffico, and Creative and Mike TGC. Thank you guys so much for sponsoring, it really means a lot. If you have any interest in becoming a sponsor yourself, please make sure to check out the link in the description for more information and all the benefits, such as being shouted out at the end of every single video and stream. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you guys next time.